And let me introduce him. We got the 2010. 2010. Heisman Trophy winner. Heisman Trophy. Hey, excuse me, sir. Can I see your ID? That is ESPN U Road Trip right there. I'm gonna try and sneak on this bus. Welcome to ESPN U Road Trip. I'm Drew Abner. And I'm Jen Brown. You are Jen Brown. <laughs> yes. Jim Brown is back. I thought that was you. Of course I'd be back. It's a BCS National Championship game. I wouldn't miss this road trip. You are a smart kid. Here <laughs> we are in Glendale, Arizona, in front of the University of Phoenix Stadium. And this is just the beginning. We're going to be all over town the next couple of days. There's so much to do, so much going on. You've got pep rallies. You've got team dinners. You've got practice. You've got VIP parties, of course. It's going to be great. And let's not forget the big game. We've got two undefeated teams, number one Auburn versus number two Oregon. It's basically where Michael James, nation's leading rusher, going up against Heisman Trophy winner Cam Newton. You're calling it a shootout, aren't you? Oh, it's a shootout for sure. I don't think it's a shootout. You're <laughs> sleeping on the defense. Nick Fairley from Auburn, monster. Yes. Eats quarter pounders for lunch. <laughs> and, and quarterbacks. quarterbacks. <laughs> Both of them. There's all the other side. I don't know who's going to stop Cam Newton, but if anyone can do it, the mastermind behind Oregon, that's Chip Kelly. So. Maybe not a shootout. Uh, we'll see. Should we get things started, though? Let's see how the teams get ready. Yeah. Head over to Media Day. Let's go to Media Day. All right. You still uh, you still got that minivan? The minivan was a rental, Jim Brown. <laughs> you know that. We went over that. You may have upgraded your situation with your sideline reporting this year. Great job, by the way. Thank you. But we have some upgrades of our own. Oh, yes. On road trip. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. What is this? This is Optimus Prime's girlfriend. <laughs> Her name is... Kaboom! Come on in. Oh come on! Look at how big it is. No, don't don't bump your head on the awesomeness. There's me. Same uh, move right there for your arm on the door. This is unbelievable. I can. How did you guys score this thing? Stole it. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Pretty awesome. They're driving for me. Next stop, media day. Hey man, I don't know if you know this. Yeah. I have four years of eligibility left. Yeah. And you're the Lombardi Award winner. I like learning from the best. Uh -huh. Can you show me some technique? Uh -huh. Obviously, I gotta play line, right? <laughs> you look at me, I saw when I walk in the room, you're like, that's a linebacker yeah. right there. You know it. No, show me something, man. What do I need to know? Like, you wanna get down? Yeah, I wanna get down. Yeah. All right. So I got you on that one, yeah. but you'll get me next time. Yeah. <laughs> Let's call it a tie. Let's call it a tie. Uh, a lot of people talk about Oregon's offense. Uh, how are you guys going to handle and contain that up-tempo? I mean, we're we going to go out there and play. I mean, this uh, the last 60 minutes of the season. I think every guy on this team got that mindset. We're going to give it all for these last 60 minutes. And they're going to have to bring a lot to us for us to just just to give up. But we're going to be ready for that fast pace. When you talk about Auburn football, everyone always likes to say, you know, everything it starts with Cam Newton. That's not true, though. It starts no, with not. you. Do you take That's offense to that? Right. No, we don't take offense to that. Uh, Cam is, uh, he's a great player, and he makes everyone on our team better. All right, Cam, uh, you know, playing for the national championship at Blinn, now playing for a national championship here, how would you compare the two as far as the media day and all these things have been going on? All right, I can give you a visual. <laughs> championship at Blinn, you know, the stakes of, of a championship at the Division I football level. So my size versus your size then? <laughs> um, the Blinn one and your... <laughs> yeah, you sitting down. <laughs> okay, I'll do that. Me standing up. <laughs> all right. But, you know, not, not to take anything against, you know, any, any junior college program, but, you know, the, 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 the bar is raised so high. You know, for, for us to be able to say, you know, we're national champions in, in America. And, uh, you know, that's something we take pride in. And, uh, you know, we're going to try to consistently, you know, wear that on our chest. What's the most fun thing you've done since you've been here in Arizona? Uh, I got to go to the Laker game. I'm a big Laker fan and just meeting Kobe Bryant after. I thought that was definitely a highlight of this trip. 
Cam Newton. I mean, how do you how are you guys going to contain him? I mean, have you talked about it? Is it is it business as usual? Or are you game planning different? I mean, have you faced anybody that you can think of that's like him? What we're going to do is we're going to put our faith and trust in our coaches. They've got they've made us successful all year long. Mm -hmm. They're going to make the play calls to put us in the right positions and help us be successful. You know, he's a great quarterback. Obviously, we got to be sound in our techniques and fundamentals, those little things. But the coaches are going to put us in a position to be successful. What do you do to keep your mind off of the game while you're here? You guys have fun things. What's the most fun thing you've done? Well, the other day, me and Remine, we sat inside the hospitality room and probably shot hoops for maybe an hour and a half from the little hoop goal we have in there. So we do things like that. You know, I'll win. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll, just, you know, I'll beat him. So you got football, you've got track, you've also got hoops. That's yeah, in your hoops. repertoire? Oh, yeah. I'm trying out for the b ball team after uh, this game. Oh, really? <laughs> the Middle East to, to see our troops. And Coach, I know that uh, coming to the end of the season, I was a 15-2 guy. Mm -hmm. 50 minutes ago, about 50 with you to play, I get in. Yeah. I know you pushed me back to a 75-2 guy from the National Championship. No, we'll be 50-2. We're still 50 If two? we're up 50 with two minutes to go, I can put you to go. OK, great. Is it, is it at all possible if, if you guys don't end up being up by 50, there's a way maybe we could get on the play cards that you have on the sidelines there? No. Think about it for a second. <laughs> well, take your time. No. I got plenty of videotape. Take your time. Just no, think about I think it a that's a, a big misconception is actually our play cards are actual plays, so we would have to name something after them. And or and there's nothing we can put in within we've got a couple days to the game, so But if I were to come up with a play to, that could stop Cam Newton, that's something you might consider. Sure. Do you have something that can stop Cam Newton? I still got some more days, right? Okay. <laughs> I guess I gotta win today. Just yeah, today. Exactly. And then tomorrow, so there's time. Okay. Yes. No way, dude, no way!